three, two, one. Okay. Yeah. Hello everyone, uh, I'm Ken Isaacs and um, today we're just talking about colours in respect of Guriella and what we were trying to do to create something new. Uh, Australian Aboriginals um, for centuries have used ochre. This is the ochre here. Uh, ochre is a part of this shale-like uh, formation. It comes in about 15 primary colours, everything right through all of your hues, from your whites uh, through into your dark yellows, your light pinks, your dark pinks, your mauves. And you can see that uh, in terms of um, what nature has to offer on a colour palette uh, in the Northern Territory in Australia uh, is pretty special. So what we're trying to do, and the reason I'm here today introducing you to this is I'm going to use these ochres, we're going to use these colours, these primary colours, with the uh, permission of uh, my Indigenous people and uh, all of the keepers of this land, and we will uh, mix these colours with oils and uh, different types of materials, so that eventually, when you see um, our Guriella Dreamtime animation, we hope to incorporate a lot of these colours that the world um, has never seen before. So. Uh, in, in, you know, in terms of uh, creating something for the indigenous people of this community, I can't think of a better way than introducing the world to 15 hues that no one's ever seen before, and we'll do that uh, with our animation in Guriella. So, um, that's, if there's a better natural rainbow uh, or colour palette around, I'm yet to see it. 